Hi, I am Stanley Smith. Uh, I farm organically in southeast Minnesota near Lewiston. I grow uh, organic corn, soybeans, and alfalfa and oats, and I have a small uh, beef herd. I am in a SARE project uh, with open pollinated corn. Uh, I hope to find a variety that grows well in my area. And then I'd like to test and see um, how much nutritional value the open pollinated corn has uh, above and beyond conventional corn. Uh, in my corn plot, I've got six different varieties of open pollinated corn and one variety of hybrid corn. The hybrid corn costs $235 for 80,000 kernels. The average cost of the open pollinated corn is $90, um, but then there's also shipping costs because some of it is not grown locally. Some of it comes from New York. Um, you have a substantial savings in seed cost. And then hopefully we'll have a much better nutritional value. And that's a second part of my SARE grant is I'm, I'll be testing the varieties for nutritional content to see how much you can save uh, putting them into a feed ration. One of the reasons why I went with open pollinated corn was cost of hybrid corn. Uh, today's hybrid corn is um, costing as much as $235 a unit and it's shipped in from all, as far away as the European Union or South America. Um, I'd like to grow things locally. And the open pollinated corn is grown locally. Um, small farms uh, can be put back into business growing their own corn or they can grow corn for their neighbors. <clears throat> I realize that open pollinated corn has a re reputation of having poor stock quality and I think that is going to be a problem. Um, if you're going to hold it for um, for shelled corn, uh, it also has problems with germination. Instead of having 95% germination, the germination will probably be closer to 90%. Um, but you can adjust that as you plant to make sure that you have the proper uh, population. Usually they recommend a, a lower population because of the stock quality problem. Um, and that's generally what I have here is a lower population. We'll have a field day on the farm and you're all invited. Uh, watch the network and we'll post a date.